What's up, baseball fans, and welcome back to Super Mega Baseball 3. This episode, I'm going to be showing you an overview of my new franchise that I'm going to be doing on this channel, and this is a franchise of my team called The Blurs. As you can see, there's the logo right there, where you're all called The Blurs. Um, this is the new franchise interface, which is a whole new game mode in uh, Super Mega Baseball 3. If anything, I'll just show you guys what's up with the uh, menu screen and stuff like that, and up with the uh, signings and uh, my teams and everything. The economy, because you get a budget now, and everything like that. Um, I'll just show you the screens and tell you what I know. Um, I'll do the best I can with like uh, signing people. I don't know if you can actually trade people. I'm not exactly sure. I don't think there's a trading um like mechanism in this game I think it's just sign and release um, people now have age so that's kind of cool people will age so people will retire um, there are some youngins in the league I mean technically it was the first year for everybody but uh, I'm gonna be doing a 30 I think it's a 32 game season um, like the last one but I'm going to have you guys um, watch a CPU CPU game so I'm not gonna be playing it so that I can make more videos for you guys because I feel like when I play I don't really do that much videos, but I feel like I can get through a lot in one day and show them to you guys and then give them day by day. Um, but yeah, the first game will be immediately after this episode is uploaded. But yeah, I'll be using the, the watch game uh, thing and obviously I got some games to simulate. But first, I guess let's just look at the league. Uh, this is the league I've got. I named it the Kingdom League and the reason why I named it that is because these teams are basically just all based off of animals. <laughs> As you can see, almost, almost all the logos are just off of um, you know, certain types of animals. I named uh, the conference that we're in, so there's two conferences, there's no divisions. There's just two, like, you know, leagues, I guess, if you, call, if you call it like National League or American League, or their conferences. I call it the Sky Conference and the Land Conference. Um, teams in the Sky Conference are the War Beasts, Chirps, Us, the Blurs. Uh, the Gazelles, Cyclones, who were a very close pick. I almost picked them. Uh, they were a very nice looking team. Uh, the Serpents and the Bards, which were like a third place team that I wanted to play with. Uh, but then in the Lance, uh, Land Conference, uh, there are the Freedoms, or f the Freedom, um, the Cobras, the, uh, the, was it the Rosers, the Rousers, might be Rousers or Rosers, I'm not exactly sure how it's pronounced. Uh, the Woodsmith, which was a very close, uh, another team I almost picked because I love their uniforms that I saw. Um, the, uh, Warblers, Gold Coats, and the Elephants. So, those are all the teams, um, in the league that we're playing in. Um, I guess we'll look at our team, and also there's actually this, like, um, activity feed screen, which you can toggle with pressing the square. And it's a news screen, you can obviously look at, uh, player transactions, retired players, assignments, income... Everything that will give you updates into the game, which are pretty cool. But, um, obviously it starts here as a start of franchise. Congratulations, you've been chosen to manage the blurs in this franchise. And, um, I actually don't see. I thought there would be a uh, way to, like, edit the league. There might not be. I'm not sure, but let's look at the team. Oh, no, I can. I can hit L2 to switch teams. All right. I, I might be able to do that. If you guys want, I can change the league, their teams' names and stuff like that, or maybe even some players. But obviously, and this is a custom franchise. This is the standard. These are all made-up teams, so I can basically do whatever the hell I want. But I'm just going to keep everything as it is right now for you guys. So, But our best player on our team is actually a pitcher. It's Grant Atkins. He's our starting ace. Obviously, you see there he's an A overall. And our best hitter is Trevor Tomeo. <laughs> he's an E-. minus, And... Uh, yeah, you see right here, the age of the players is really cool. Our oldest guy is Bobo Sosa. He's 38 years old. So that's uh, interesting. We do have a couple of youngins. We have 20, 21-year-olds and stuff like that. It's really cool. And you get a salary of players, which is very nice. Uh, here's what everybody looks like. And you can see we got uh, Luna Anger, Flip Smith, Trevor Tomeo, uh, Johnny Waters, uh, uh, Sloan Kelly, I think it's pronounced, Jackson Fry. Sean Charles, uh, Myra Blevins, um, Reina Pe Corino, Pecorino, I think that's how you pronounce it, Samson Livingston, uh, Taylor Elliott, Leo Grimes, and Taylor Phelps. And pitching, we got uh, Grant Atkins, Amina Ali, uh, Angel Powell, uh, Powell, Nico Holland, Phil Patton, Bobo Sosa, uh, Chris Mc McMahon. I don't know why. I couldn't pronounce that for some reason. And January Cisneros. 
And that's our uh, closer. We actually have a closing pitcher. We don't. We do have a long relief guy, but we don't have four guy uh, bullpen. We have um, technically, well, technically do. We technically do have a four guy bullpen, but he is. Uh, I think Nico Holland is in our rotation. I'm almost certain. Uh, I, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure he's the part of the rotation. I think it's still that you can have four in a rotation. I don't know if you can change that or not, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see when he comes up. Um, how uh, Holland, if he comes up to pitch in a the game, um, then we'll see. This is the lineup page, obviously. You can do your uh, substitutions or player swaps or batting order swaps and everything like that. Team stats are here, obviously, nothing yet. Um, if you want to look at our team, this is our look. Um, all right, uh, the highlighted one right here is the away uniforms. They look very nice, and the other highlighted is the homes. I don't know. I just like the colors. I like the mint green for some reason and the uh, the forest green. Um, it's team colors. I don't know why. I just, it, it sparked my interest. I, I like the look. I like to look at the team, and um, I didn't do any changes, so I don't really need to save anything. Our home ballpark is Founders Park, which is the green -ish ballpark. It wasn't the one that I played with in the uh, first gameplay, the first look video. I played at, uh, I think, Lafayette Corner or something. Like, I think that's what it's called. But we're playing at Founders Park, which is a very nice stadium. You guys see it. It's it's very nice. A lot of seats. Honestly, it would look, it would look like a tremendous ballpark to watch a ball game at. Um, the, and this is a team photo of the team. You can see everybody's personalities and everything, how everybody looks. Uh, obviously, without hats, you can see their hair. It's awesome. You can switch teams, so that's cool. And I think I can edit anything. I can pretty much edit. Wherever, yeah, I can edit wherever I want. So, if anything, if you guys want me to, if there's not, if there's some teams that you don't like the names of, then I can just change it to the next season. Be like, oh, they uh, they changed to another team. They got relocated or some sort of you know thing. But uh. But yeah, that is a look at our team and at our league. Um, this is the sign and release phase, and this is the free agent pool, so you can get a bunch of free agents. The only problem I have with these free agents is that they ask for a lot of money. Like this one guy right here, he's asking for 23.4 mil. He's an A minus player. I mean, that's pretty good, but geez. And there's guys like down here, like who's a B minus player, he's asking for 13 million dollars. And or this guy, Bear Guerrero, who's a D plus player, not a good ball player. And he's asking for 3.2 mil. I mean, I don't know if this, the economy in this game is just way the hell up, but I don't know. And you can toggle pitchers too. I actually didn't realize that. You can toggle pitchers by hitting R1. These are all the pitchers that are available in free agency. And uh, you can hit L1 by going to your players and to release them, you can just click them and release a player and then get it. I think the rule is is that if you release a pitcher, you have to re you have to sign a free agent pitcher. Like you can't release a pitcher and then get a, a fielder. In free agency, you have to, you know, release a batter for a batter, release a pitcher for a pitcher. That's that's how it works. So, oh my God, big, we big long throb. Oh my God, I'm burping. I might have to, I might have to sign that guy. I love, I love the name already. I've heard that name before, Mc Long Throb. <laughs> you guys, let me know. But uh, yeah, and here's the economy page. It basically shows us um, like how our wallet is doing. Our total budget is 152 mil. Team payroll is 127 mil 300,000, and our surplus is uh, 24.7 mil. And player development uh, budget, which is there, um, I'll show you guys that in a bit. Um, I think what it is right here, it is player development. I think what this is is that you kind of like buy certain tr uh, traits for somebody or a boost for somebody's trait, like uh, this one says 5% chance to gain power versus left-handed pitchers. Or well, this one, that is, uh, let's see, these are sure to take, hold on. These are sure to shake off the pesky urge to sleep. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, expire, expiry, expiry, I don't know how to pronounce that. Odds, 0% for three games. So, but you can get them in like a certain amount, of, in a certain amount of games, which is interesting. I guess they'll pop up down here in the new opportunities, so I'll see what that's all about when that ever pops up. But, um, yeah, I think that's about it. Everything that I've shown you is what I've seen in this game, in this, uh, little mode here. Um, in the next episode will be game one of our season. Actually, you know what? I gotta show you guys our schedule. Here's our schedule. Um, we are facing off against the Bards at Bards at their stadium for the first two games, and then we go play the Cobras, and then we come home to play the Rousers for one game, and then we go play the Trips, and then we go on a little home stand. So. But here's every game. I'll go down the list right here really quick. Um, so yeah, we play 32 games, and then the postseason. There are a total of 14 teams in this league, 
um, only the top two teams in the conference will make the playoffs, so there'll be one um, conference round, and then there will be the championship. All in five games. They're not seven-game series. They're all five-game series. So even the World Series is a, is a five-game series. You have to go up, win up the three games to uh, win a, either your conference um, title or your World Series title. So that is it. Hopefully we can get through a bunch of seasons with this. I'm very into this game right now, and I want to play as much as possible so that uh, it would be kind of cool to, like, create some history in this game. I kind of like the idea to create our own history. So what do you guys think? Let me let me know in the comments below and leave a like uh, on like, you know, tap that like button um, if you enjoyed it and you want to see more. That basically tells me if you want me to see, if you guys want to see more. So thanks again, and I'll see you guys in game one of our new franchise.